Hello, my name is Heather Gibbons and I'm here to talk about our Dynamic Mobile Banking offering and how we've integrated it into our software portfolio. The first use case I want to show you is doing a pre-stage transaction. So, if you look in the mobile banking application, you can just do a withdrawal and set it up ahead of time. I want to withdraw cash, $20, proceed. And with this, I'm going to get a one-time pin that we can use. We also have use cases where we do um, QR codes and then also facial recognition with cardless tap with using NFC. So when you come in here, I'm going to select mobile transaction and enter my one-time pin. You're going to see it's for $20, what I set it up for, and the cash automatically comes out of the terminal. I'm going to show a use case where we've integrated our dynamic monitoring tool into the ATM software as well. What I'm doing is simulating taking the ATM out of service and what you're going to see is it's going to show you all of the other areas where there's ATMs that a customer could go to. What we're trying to do here is make sure that it's a really good consumer experience even though the terminal's down. And by integrating in with dynamic monitoring, what we're able to do is to be able to do the next best location for them to be able to go to, to make sure that they're going somewhere where the terminal is going to be up, and also that it has the capability like being able to make deposits. So I'll select the next best area, and what you can see is I can put in my mobile phone number, and it'll actually send me a notification on my phone that's going to show me where that next best ATM is to go to. And what I can do from that standpoint is be able to click on a map um, to be able to take me and give me driving directions. We also have that integrated into the iWatch um, iPhone so you can see the next best location there and be able to click on that as well. And then for the third scenario, what we're going to show is we've heard a lot from customers and from research that Consumers want financial institutions to be able to help them make better decisions when it comes to their finances. So that's exactly what we're doing by integrating into online banking as well. And in this scenario, what I'm going to do is do a simple cash withdrawal for $300. And what it's going to come back and tell me is, um, do you really want to be able to do that? Because you have other um, transactions that are scheduled from a bill payment perspective. And so it's helping me be smarter about the financial decisions that I'm making. So you're going to see up here in the upper left-hand corner, it's going to give me an alert. Do you really want to do this? Here's your payments that you have coming. I have the ability to send a notification to my mobile phone to make sure to remind me. I can change my account. I can enter a lesser amount. Or I can, can continue with my $300. So these are just three simple use cases about how we're integrating Dynamic Mobile along with our ATM software to give a better overall consumer experience and have more seamless integration across all of our channels.